بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم today إن شاء الله I'm gonna complete the next lecture on goal one page sixty six and page sixty seven but before that I want to make with you a quick revision on page sixty five please open your people's book page sixty five. So if you remember that lesson, we talk or we discuss a lot of things and the last section of it is talking about possessive adjective and possessive pronoun. So we want to answer the last question is letter C. Complete the conversation, choose the correct words. We have a conversation between mom and Hamid, okay? And we want to use possessive uh, uh, adjectives and possessive pronouns with it. Mom, which soccers are your you, or yours? We should use yours is the suitable answer. So yours. Number two, Hamid. The black one or ones, the, the red ones aren't my or mine. So the black ones, the black one. The red ones aren't my or mine. The suitable answer is mine. I think there are alleys. I think there are alleys. They are his or him size. They are his size. Okay. Mom, is this your or yours hat? Is this your or yours hat? Is this your hat? Is this your hat? Hamid, no. That is too or enough small for me. That is too small. My or mine is the blue one. So, mine is the blue one. Mom, whose or who back bag, back, uh, sorry, back bag is this? So, uh, what we said, we said, Whose backpack is this? Hamid, which one or which ones? Let me see. Which ones? Let me see. Okay. And mom, the blue ones or the blue one and this football kit. What we say, the blue one. This football is this football kit. Whose or who does the, this belong to? It is to or enough clean to be Alice. It is two. And before that, we should use who does this. And the last, uh, the last uh, one, Hamid, it is mine or my football kit. That is my football kit. I missed the training on Saturday. Have you seen my football boots? Have you seen? My football boots. Mom, perhaps if you tidy up, you might be able to find them yourself. Okay. Now open your pupil's book again on page 66, preparing for a new lesson. Okay. So the next lesson is talking about project. If you want to prepare a project on unit four. So the art of advertising project, we have a lot of pictures here around and we have mind map and some titles, uh, slogan, product you want to advertise and interesting words about it and how it is better than other products. So if you want to make advertising for a product or something, you should mention some points and something lit your product amazing and different I had a special things make them different for another product let we begin so working groups choose a saudi product to advertise internationally use the organizer to make notes then use it to write a description of the product for a website or catalog advertisement Use the other advertisement in the unit as examples. Number three, find photos for your advertisement and present in the class. Choose the best advertisement. 
And the last one is modify your advertisement so it can be used for television, commercial film, or uh, demonstrate in a class. Okay. At first, we should write the name for product. They they mentioned to us that in fr uh, question one, uh, choose a Saudi product to advertise internationally. If I want to choose, for example, Saudi product, we have a lot of products in our country. For example, let we talk about um, let we talk about industry. For for example, paper industry. That's one of the products in Saudi Arabia. Okay. Or let we talk about a famous things that Saudi is uh, um, uh, special about it. For example, uh, sweet or uh, dates. This is one of uh, uh, products of Saudi Arabia. Okay, let we choose in the dates. So if I want to talk about uh, the title of it, I should write, for example, kind of dates in Saudi Arabia. I should write that one. Let we use in a pen, for example, I should write kind, I use another pen, kind of Saudi's dates, I have a mistake here, sorry for that, I will try to Using an eraser, using pen again, Saudi dates. Okay, that is the about the slogan of it. Product you want to advertise. So I I big uh, a big um, title for that. After that, I will specify one of that kind. For example, when I when I choose, I choose for example. Ajwat al Medina is one of the kind of Saudi dates. So I will write about uh, Al Medina dates or Ajwat al Medina. Okay, product you want to advertise, for example, Al Medina dates. That one of Saudi dates. After that, interesting word about it. When I want to choose an interesting word about the product which I'm using now, I should use an amazing things which make the reader, when, when, when he read my advertisement in a magazine, in a newspaper, in advertise outside, he, um, he should think that is the best what he need for him or for his family, okay? So if I want to choose, uh, talking about the dates and Medina dates, I should describe what is the benefit for that date. For example, uh, number one, I want to write words about it. Good for health. That one. Okay. For example, that one example. Number two, good price. Number three. Special day dates. Only product from Al Medina. Okay, the three sentences. If I want to talk about interesting words or interesting sentence about Al Medina dates. Okay. If now we have another question, how it is better than other products? So now I, I want to make a dialogue between the dates, Al Medina dates, and the other dates. So, number one, good for health. What is the difference between the other dates we have? We have a lot of dates, and in Iraq also they have a lot of dates, in other countries they have. But no countries have Ajwat Al Medina, only in Saudi Arabia. So, if I want to talking about the health. What is, what is the difference between the dates and Al Medina dates? For example, I will write one sentence. I, I said, for example, uh, a lot of vitamins. Lot of vitamins. Okay, this is number one. Number two, 
about the price. I should make a, a, a distinguish between the price between a Medina date and the other date. So for example, if I want to choose another date as a sukkari, for example, khlas, we found that I have a high price. So the other dates have high price. Okay, number three, special dates only product from Al Medina. So the other dates can be product, can be grown on other countries. If I want to talk about that, I should uh, give uh, a meaningful sentence and uh, I don't use a long sentences to uh, keep the reader uh, still uh, uh, still lovely to read and still want to uh, follow my advertisement. Okay, this is about uh, project for today. Let me check the other page. What we have? Uh, sorry about that. Okay, and on page, I will go back again. Yes. Start using the pen. Yes, the next page. Okay, the ne next page we have timetable is talking about also advertisement so we have self reflection here about unit 4 and how to organize your ideas how to organize your information and you uh, your new things which you learn it before on unit 4 okay we we just give um, a, a brave information and in next lecture inshallah we will talk more specific about it so thing is that i liked about unit 4 what do you like in unit 4 about me i liked the way and they teach me how can i make advertisement about my product that number one for example and after that things that i didn't like very much for example i didn't like to read uh, the passage about credit card and just that example for example okay after that they talking about things that i found easy in unit four i found a lot of things easy as uh, grammar as possessive pronoun as uh, uh, article with a and n as uh, what we mentioned before as uh, how can I use the question who, how can I use one and ones, all that is easy for us. Things that I found difficult in, for, uh, in unit four. I think that when uh, the difficult things for you, uh, nothing difficult with you. If you began from zero, you can uh, reach to the point you want to reach it. So. Don't put in your mind that everything or you have something difficult in your book. Okay, on unit four checklist. So talk about commercial ads and product history. That's what we talk about products and ads and how to make advertisement for it. I can do this very well or I can do this quite well or I can, I need to study practice more. So uh, try to uh, both sign in any uh, under common that you think that yourself under of it. Describe product. If you are get ready to, br br uh, to uh, describe your product, you should use any common suitable to you. After that, make comparison. If you uh, professional on make comparison or you can't make comparison, you should uh, put any sign under of that common. Use the passive, that's what we talking before. Use comparative and superlative. Use as and as. And use the verbs look, smile, sound, and taste with like and noun. Use the identifying article a and an. And use possessive adjective and pronoun. Ask a question with whose. And use one or ones and two and enough. The last things that, or the last section of timetable in your self-reflection is 
my, my five favorite new words from unit four. You should write five at least uh, that you love it or you add it to your dictionary uh, as a new words in your world, okay? And uh, if you are still not sure about something from unit four, they put some points after, uh, under of it, read through the unit again and listen to the audio material, study the grammar and functions from the unit again, and ask your teacher for help. Thank you for sharing and thank you for coming and have a nice day.